<laughs> sure, so inside you can see we still have the analog dial arrangement. This dial is actually a digital screen, which shows you your charge time, the sport mode that you're in, and everything. Everything is obviously hand machined at the factory, all the knurling, all the detailing. The switch gear is all brass switch gear to repeat the accents on the outside. And in the middle, we have an original Lucas Bakelite magneto switch for selecting the modes. You have reverse, neutral, and drive, or R&D, research and development. Британские автопроизводители умеют чтить свое прошлое. 108 лет эволюции. Дизайн остается прежним, а вот технологии меняются. Сейчас в Женеве в 2016 году я сижу за рулем электрического трицикла Morgan. Да, в магазин на нем съездить не очень удобно. Зато каждая секунда за рулем становится настоящим приключением. This car into sort of a, a mule testing phase a couple of years ago now. We've been testing the car just as a normal three-wheeler, but without the engine on the front. So now we decided that it is production ready, we've launched this production prototype with the restyled front end. So the idea is this still is a coach-built car. It still has a wooden frame. It's still made completely bespoke to the customer. And it really has all the essence that all the other Morgans do. But the focus is on making an electric car, which is still fun to drive. So um, around the front, the brass fins are functional. These are a heat sink to keep the batteries cool as the car is driving. Uh, the car is very focused on aerodynamics with a dipped nose and a raised tail and this smooth, streamlined body on one side. And on the other side, we have the detail, the driver's head form, the roll hoop, the steering wheel, the mirror, and the single asymmetric headlight on the front. The side pods fuel the air to the rear motor, which is located behind the seats and drives the rear wheel. And um, the sort of low-slung hot rod lamps just add to that forward stance and act as running lights too. This car will do about 150 miles on a charge. Um, the charge time can be anything between 45 minutes and 8 hours, depending on how a car is charged. So it's a very usable range. Um, the performance figures are quite similar to that of the combustion car. So this still is a very fast car. It's quite easy to unsettle the back wheel if you wish and, and drive the car slightly sideways if you like. And again, it is focused on driver performance. It's got a 46 kilowatt electric motor in the rear. Um, which is just behind the driver's seat and you can hear this whirring up and it still does have quite a lot of audio sound. Oh, really? You hear the wind a lot more too and it still is a car for the senses as well. Um, essentially one of the points to make is that it's actually lighter than the combustion vehicle. The car only weighs 500 kilograms so um, the performance to weight ratio is, is good. Okay, and acceleration? Acceleration at the moment we're saying around about nine figures but uh, testing indicates it's probably going to be slightly faster than that. Um, but again, the car is so light and you're so open to the air and the elements, it feels a great deal quicker than that. Quicker than that, yeah. <laughs> uh, may I ask you just, I'm curious, uh, uh, what is the design language of a family company? It was working in a family company during years and years. How it develops? On, uh, on the design. Uh, what mean design for the Morgan? Um, so design for Morgan is brilliant, really. You have um, a very big ingredients list. I mean, Morgan are coach building cars. So we have a well-proven modern chassis with a modern engine and on top of that we hand sculpt a wooden frame um, and on top of that we're handcrafting aluminium and we're trimming with real leather. So when you sort of combine these elements and start looking at the design it's nice to stay respectful towards those materials. So if it looks like wood it is wood and we bend and shape and curve the wood within its natural constraints. Um, we work with the leather within its natural constraints and you're trying to just stay very honest and respectful to the way these cars are built as well as the materials they're using. We have a lot of brand language. We have a, a proportion on the classics with a long bonnet and a rearward driving position sat over the rear wheels. And that comes through in every car. And we have a lot of history, 107 years of history to repeat and be inspired by, as well as trying to move the brand forward like this. Good morning, my name is Jonathan Wells. I'm the head of design at Morgan Motor Company. Bravatania Avto Panorama. <laughs>